This is El Sonte, known locally as Bitcoin Beach. This small Salvadoran tourist town is home to a variety of small businesses whose owners all have one thing in common, cryptocurrency. Tourists who didn't bring cash would come and say they wanted to eat something, and they asked if they could pay in Bitcoin. I said to myself, this is a good strategy. I'm going to use Bitcoin and I'm going to start collecting. I downloaded the app and I started selling a lot more. The success of the Bitcoin Beach project has boosted the popularity of cryptocurrency in El Salvador. And on Wednesday, the government announced Bitcoin would become legal tender. Therefore, the law of Bitcoin is approved. Supporters of the measure say the new law represents a vote of confidence in using blockchain technology to bring informal sector workers into a 21st century economy. And the banks are not necessary. This is another important thing. There are many Salvadorans in this country that cannot use a bank because they have thousands of requirements. El Salvador now becomes the first country in the world to formally legalize a digital currency. The initiative was led by El Salvador's president, Nayib Bukele. On Twitter, he called the passing of the Bitcoin law historic. In the short term, this will generate jobs and help provide financial inclusion to thousands outside the formal economy. And in the medium and long term, we hope that this small decision can help us push humanity at least a tiny bit into the right direction. There are also critics who warn of the risks of Bitcoin price fluctuations. The moment Bitcoin becomes a legal currency, problems appear, including in its most basic use, which is a form of exchange. And this is related to the volatility of the price of Bitcoin.